Hey y'all, it's Aviva Axel. Welcome back to Drag Infinity. So in this video, I'll be doing my TikTok followers makeup. But before we get into the video, make sure you subscribe to the channel and like this video if you haven't already. So yeah, let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so we're gonna first start off with, oh shit. Okay, so we're gonna first start off with her eyebrows. I always like to start off with eyebrows um, or like foundation, but we can start off with her eyebrows first because she doesn't need much foundation. So I'm gonna pick the darkest tone of her eyebrows, which is this, and then I'm gonna go on to the air tool and then find like, um, oops, and then I'm gonna like, yeah, draw it basically. There's no need for any like concealing because her eyebrows are already so good. Like, oh my God, so, yeah. I'm just going to fill them in just to make them more bold. And then, yeah. Okay, so that's really good. Now I'm going to go on to, and blur the, like, wait, let me just fill this in a bit more. Now I'm going to, like, blur the inner bits. Oh, God, that's too much. I'm going to blur the inner bits just to kind of make them fade in a bit more. I don't want them to be too blocky. So, yeah. Now I'm going to be going on for the eyeshadow. So for eyeshadow, I'm going to go for a very dramatic retro look like I did on this other girl before um because I feel like it will really create a really nice sort of look on her because she's wearing a yellow shirt so I really want to contrast it I'm trying to get inspiration from what they're wearing just so I know like what colors they like and stuff because I don't want to be doing a makeup look that I don't like you know what I mean so now I'm going to be doing a yellow inside so yellow and yellow inside and then I'm going to just erase all the excess in her like eye like, you know, like, the excess. Because the excess always goes in the eye. Like, you can't really help that. So now I'm going to go for the first eye eyeshadow look. I mean, not eyeshadow. Eyeliner look. So I'm going to do, like, a really high opacity one. Like that. And that. Okay, so now um, we've done that. I'm going to do a crease. So for the crease, I'm going to go for a lower opacity. And then I'm going to do that. Oh, well, let me just do this a I need to kind of get this like crease quite good because we won't be able to change it later. So yeah. Yeah, that looks really good. And I might do it again and then blur it just so it doesn't look too like blocky. So let's just blur it out. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, guys, if you want your makeup done in my next video, all you need to do is subscribe to the YouTube channel, which is Drag Infinity. You're watching it on my YouTube channel right now. So yeah, um, subscribe to the channel and then send proof that you subscribe on my YouTube. Okay, so now we're going to start off with eyeliner. So for eyeliner, I'm going to go on the line tool with a high opacity and then I'm going to go up, up, up. And then I'm now going to um, fill them in. So let's just color it in. Oh, yeah, a lot of people are saying my eyeliner looks really weird. I don't even know what looks weird about it. It looks so good. Look at my gosh. But, yeah. And then, so, like, kind of, obviously, it's not, like, attached. So, if you want to attach it, go on a high opacity on the eye air tool and then, like, kind of do this. So, it looks like it's, like, flowing better. So, yeah. And then I'm going to go on to the other eye and then do the same thing. So, yeah. And this... The always the like eye that is not facing towards the camera is just goes really strange because of the angle and I just literally just do like anything to be honest. It doesn't really matter. Like that. Yeah. And now I'm gonna be doing the bottom eyeliner. So the bottom eyeliner I like to go for a lower opacity but quite thicker. Just kind of give more a dramatic look. So yeah. Um so I'll go for like um like two maybe. And then I'm gonna go for a little leak through. So I'm gonna go for the yellow and leak it in. So yeah. If you know what leak it in means, it means basically when you go on the bottom eyeliner and kind of have this matching. It doesn't actually have to be matching. It just can be any color, but it has to be other than black. So yeah. Okay, now I'm going to be going on for concealer. For, for concealer, she does have like a few like pigments. It's not that bad. I'm not saying it's bad. Um, but it can like be better. So yeah. So I'm just going to do that. Only a little bit. I don't want it to be too like over the top. Because, yeah, that's it. That's enough. And then for the lips, I don't want to go for yellow. Yellow looks so bad on, like, your face. I mean, your lips. So I'm going to be going for a black. So I'm going to do a black lip look. That's a bit too. Okay, I might be able to do this. I'm not sure. 
Okay. Yeah, and then I'm gonna blur it out just to kind of, um, what's it called? I don't know what it's called. To make it look more natural. Now I'm gonna be doing the contour. So for contour, I'm gonna go for a darker tone on her face. So yeah, that's got a darker tone. And then I'm gonna kind of go in like this. Nope, not that much. And then for this, I don't know, just wing it, you know. Oh yeah, guys, I've also done her makeup on a on my TikTok. So go for my TikTok, you'll find it. I did a different look, I didn't do this. But this look has been done before. I really like this, probably my favorite. And then now I'm going to be doing some blush. I'm not going to do blush, but I'm going to do highlight though. Because she's already got quite rosy cheeks, which is really good. So yeah, now I'm going to do um, nose contour. So no contour, I'm going to go for the white. High opacity. Oops. Not that big. Down like that. Maybe the tip. Yeah. She, it's already like shining on the tip. Maybe another one. No. Okay. One's enough. Now for brown. Contour, obviously. Nope. Okay. Yeah. That looks really good. And then just blur the top out. Just the top, like... It does leak through, so make sure you blur that out. And yeah, that's the end of my makeup look. I hope you like this video. Um, it was really good because I didn't have to do foundation, just a few contouring and highlighting. Um, if you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you want your makeup done in my future videos. Um, follow me on TikTok, YouTube, and Snapchat. My Snapchat is Dragon Definity. I'm so active and I love Snapchat so much, so make sure you go follow me there. And yeah, I'll see you next video. Bye, y'all.